For I am not ashamed of the gospel of Christ, for it is the power of God to salvation for everyone who believes, for the Jews first and also for the Greeks. Romans 1 16. I'm reminding you and myself also that God promises never to leave us nor forsake us. If you are new or already a part of my YouTube family, I'm Erica, a lovely welcome. In today's video, I'm going to give you guys a bit of a update in regards to this hair that I now am wearing in my hair. I literally just installed this, had it now for about two days. The hair that I did go ahead and use is the Free Trust braid and it is the Nubian Spring Twist and this is the color t27 now if you guys know me or have seen any of my videos in regards to twist i usually do mini twist and i use just like the regular bulk hair however these ones uh, they were already pre-separated so they wrote individual nubian twist i'm gonna give you guys a little bit show you guys a little bit what that looks like now um i've never installed them this thick before as you can see it really looks like i kind of have dreads in my hair i kind of like the look and this is so lightweight by the way i honestly i like the color i do however what i was trying to go for is more of a twist i think they look more like dreads but i can work with it i don't have to worry about getting up and fixing them if i want to go out it's already done all i really got to do is my edges right if you guys have seen any of my videos in regards to mini twists i'm going to link them up here I usually go a lot smaller it doesn't look that bad but like i said it looks more like i have in dreads so i kind of wanted that softer look though because this looks um like more of a coarser texture and it kind of reminds me of expression braid it has that coarse texture but the thing is is that it's lightweight it's really not heavy i installed about two packs this is what the hair looks like i paid about three dollars for this hair so this is how it looks this is the packet that came in and this is the um the color like i said t27 it is the two times nubian spring twist i'm not sure what length this is after I remove it from the packet, like this is one strand and folded, maybe it's about like unstretched, maybe about eight inches, eight, 12 inches. I could be wrong. So it's pretty, sh um, right? Stretchy. And of course it stretches. I did not cut this hair. I have about maybe about like six, seven pieces left over. What I did is I just tugged on it a bit, both sides. And then once you start tugging on it, this is what will happen. And then from there, you can separate the hair. Um, so I go from both ends, pull that apart. And then in the middle, and then I unravel it and I separate. Now, I for some of these, like the smaller ones at the front, for, um, for one of these, I separated it uh, twice and two pieces i get two pieces and then that's how i would install so i just braid it in so like i said if you see that if you've seen any of my hair videos like my um uh twist videos i start braiding from the roots maybe about five times and then i twist down what i do as well is i take my hair and i try to like once it's installed and I'm twisting it, um, I get my hair and I separate it into two. And then I kind of use the extension hair to conceal it and then twist. I hope that makes sense to you guys. Just so that way my hair isn't peeking through. Yeah, so just so my hair isn't peeking through. So I just go in and I would take my hair, separate it, and then I would conceal it. And then I got my twist going. Again, honestly, if you want to see a more in-depth tutorial or if you want to see an in-depth tutorial, let me know. But in regards to this hair, it's a very easy install. Um, like I said, it's a bit coarse, very lightweight, and it's easy to work with in terms of separating the hair. Just pull it, tug on it, and then separate it into two, and then braid and twist, and you're okay. I think um, the smaller sections you have, the better. 
because um or it all depends on how you want it if you guys do choose to try this hair but like i said i would have really preferred a softer feel because this hair it does feel a bit coarse but then i'm like you know what if i kind of like the look of getting dreads then this will work perfectly right so my kids i have it in and my kids actually thought that i had dreads in i paid about four dollars per pack i ended up purchasing four packs and i only needed two because it's two um, bundles per pack so i used like four packs of hair but because there's two in one right so i only had to purchase i only had to use two packs i purchased four but i used two and um i still have some more left over this far into this video i am here to talk about hair but i'm here to talk about the one who cares enough to number them and that is god god almighty jesus christ i know that there's a lot happening in this world right now and there's a lot of fear that's taking place however god said that he didn't give us a spirit of fear I find that once we are watching the news and the media and stuff, it's okay to be aware, right? But at the same time, our focus as Christians, as believers, should be on Jesus Christ. If we don't have that firm foundation in Jesus Christ, we will, I guarantee you, we will lose hope. But I'm praying to God that we will remain strong in the Lord and we will stand firm on the Lord because the word of God says we're to be like that wise man that built his house on the rock. And all the storms of life that came and it beat upon that house, but that house didn't fall down because why? The house was planted on Christ Jesus, who's our firm foundation. My hope is in Jesus Christ. I'm also hoping that if you're watching this video, that in spite of what you're faced with, the trials, the difficulties, the stress, the sleepless night, the headache, the uncertainty, I guarantee you, if you put your trust in your full hope and confidence in Jesus Christ, he will never fail you. Things might not go as work out as quickly as you want them to work out, or it might, but trust in Jesus Christ because he will give you that hope. He will give you the hope that you so desperately desire. Don't look for it in man. Don't look for it in people because you will not find it. I've tried. I've tried to be in relationships, to be with someone, to find my worth, to uh, for someone to love me, to cherish me and to care about me. And it didn't work. But Jesus said that he will never... The word of God says that he will never, ever leave us nor forsake us. So wherever you are, whoever you are today listening to this message, God has a plan and a purpose for your life. I hope you're watching this video and you're hearing what I'm saying to you. God bless you. Thanks for stopping by. I do pray that you'll stop by for my next video. God willing. Bye for now. Bye.